The use of wood as a source of energy is prevalent in Kenya, especially among rural homes. However, continued reliance on wood fuel poses a risk to the environment as trees are cut to provide this fuel. This is why a local entrepreneur is now making high-quality GCOs that save fuel energy and ensure high efficiency, at the same time reducing the amount of wood one would need to get the energy. Edward Chua tells us how Cookswell GCOs is also promoting organic farming by making biochar and condensing smoke into wood vinegar. This compound in Kitengela is a beehive of activity, from welding to spraying. This is Cookswell Jikos Manufacturing Center, where energy-saving Jikos are made Teddy Kinyanjui is the director of this venture. Cookswell Jikos was founded in 1984 uh, by my late father, Professor Maxwell Kinyanjui. We provide all the tools for people who want to use wood fuel sustainably. So if you're using charcoal, if you're using firewood, you can come to Cookswell to learn how to not only grow the trees, but how to make charcoal efficiently, and then how to use it in high efficient, easy to use Jikos as well. Cookswell sources all the raw materials needed locally. Kinyanjui has a team of at least 10 people helping with the making and selling of the jikos. He trains his artisans on how to make high-quality jikos. From the Mobati comes from the rolling mills here in Kenya. We make over 30 different types of jikos. We really like to do those custom-made type of designs. Um, we'll work with you, with your restaurant, with your hotel, exactly what size you need. Do you need two boilers, one boiler, an oven? New fanyakazia. Painting, washing, nimefanya kwa miaka tisa sai. Amiri ya nyayi ni kuja kama sijui, kazi nimefunzo wa hapa. Ya indo imenisaidia kule ya watoto wangu, ulipa nyumba. Kazi yagu ni kushikanisha majiko hapa. Nimefanya ya kuanzia 2013. Hii kazi diyo nalishaka nao familia yangu, diyo imenisaidia ku kumove on na maisha vizuri sana. Nikikuja nilikuwa najua kuchoma lakini kuna experience mingi sana nilipata wakati nilikuja. Cookswell also makes chako making kilns. Through the kilns, the venture is now promoting organic farming by making biochar and converting the smoke into hood vinegar. We've developed a very simple pipe that goes on top of the charcoal making kiln that condenses the smoke as it's going through the pipe and what comes out of that is known as wood vinegar. Uh, wood vinegar is a very effective organic pest control agent. We have lots of customers who are buying our kilns to make their own wood vinegar and would like to be able to make not only the wood vinegar at home but also their own charcoal and also their own biochar for farming. Francisca Mutua has been using the Cookswell Jico in her bakery business. I have been using the Cookswell Jikos for one year. I bake breads, I bake queen cakes, I bake cakes. Apart from it being able to save uh, the fuel that I'm using while baking, it's something that you can use well in rural areas where we understand that not many areas that have electricity. Kinyanju says Cookswell has now gone beyond the Jikos. The venture is now keen on ensuring hood fuel is more sustainable by encouraging growing of more indigenous trees. This they do by distributing indigenous tree seeds with the jikos. We have what we call the seed to ash cycle. This entails growing enough trees to make that supply sustainable and then only using the branches. The jikos sell between 500 shillings and 80,000 shillings and Kinyanjui says Cookswell has now found a market beyond Kenya as the products continue to gain popularity. We've been working a lot more with business to business. We recently have been actually exporting. We have a partner in Switzerland who has been taking, he's taken two containers so far. The European market seems to really appreciate the quality of handmade materials. Cookswell's plan for the future is to look for new opportunities, especially outside Kenya, as the Made in Kenya brand continues to grow exponentially. I think in the future we're going to look more into doing local production in Tanzania, in Uganda. Uh, the Made in Kenya brand is very strong, even among our neighbors. Uh, we do get a lot of requests from South Sudan, from uh, Goma, you know, Malawi, Zambia. Edward Choya, Made in Kenya, Citizen TV.